the 20th of March, we are bringing South Africa to a standstill. Nothing moves, nothing goes, no child goes to school, no worker goes to work, because this president must step down. We want a president that is in love with a black nation. We don't want a president who gives us a load shading. We don't want a president who presides over more than 50% of unemployed young people. We don't want a president who presides over a collapsed primary health care and public health care in South Africa. Education has collapsed. Our schools have become a danger zone because children are killing each other there. Why? The government of the day has lost control over our schools. We don't want a government led by a president who is not in sympathy with our people because of the levels of poverty. Today, our women are being raped, are being killed, are being beaten up without any consequences because so, comrades, 20th of March, we are reclaiming what belongs to us. This government must come back to the hands of the people. It must not be the government of the few. Today, Nerebutwaka State Capture, today there is a bigger state capture in government. How can a president put money in a mattress and not just money, dollars of money in a mattress in the sofas and violate the laws of South Africa till today no one has been arrested. Hakitamo Barre, there is a cash in transit go to back in one of the big roads. The crime levels in South Africa have gone too high. Why? Because when the president breaks the law, nothing happens to the president. That's why no one is scared of the law. They do as they wish because the president has violated the law without consequences. He can continue to be a president of the country after violating his oath of office. When he took office, he said he will respect the laws of South Africa. Today, number one citizen violates the laws. What about ordinary citizen? If a number one citizen who's meant to defend and protect the constitution violates the constitution. Let's go and reclaim our constitution. Let's go and reclaim our office of the president, which must be occupied by ethical person who will not sleep with criminals. Ukenya di dola ko di coaching, haba di utwa, habu li case. Wa usula zula bat ba utujen di dola tela like a criminal, like a thug. Pela di toti jamo zon teti ni mo, hau ka utwan to ya bona, haba iko police station, ka orli bona ba utujen tweu. Ah, eh, baba, 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 hey, ala bona mfano mungo wapero ovorole redi so. President ba utuche di tola chai, uba taba tuwa uka rikito otilien. Kani hauli a respectable individual who respect the constitution and the law. Haba utuwe di cha, uba tani li di toti, uya ko police station, wa report a case, ba ufa case number. Bow for investigating officer wa follow up. What does he do? Unka hilkop tayarona without a case number. Go to Namibia to go and look for those people unauthorized. Anke ma polisa arona without case number. Atware mewoa sebet ankontung. Bamu tochare inside palapala. Retsweri kile mene mene langwe kulu barke ramaposa in that office. So, kadi 20 tam March, let's all go to Pretoria, Romuhula kanko, 
or officier ya president e ka se occupa ke skatana sa ramaphosa so all of us south africa must come to a stand still on the 20th of march we are demanding our government we are demanding our dignity let power be restored in the hands of the people not in the hands of criminals that occupy the union building amanda amanda long live